Welcome to my next video. Today we will see how we can generate purchase orders that is LPOs from Tally Prime. The first step is to ensure that we have enabled the voucher type purchase order. So to enable the purchase order, we will go to the alteration, we will go to voucher types, and you can select purchase order and you ensure please ensure that activate this voucher type as yes and accept the screen once this is checked you can go to vouchers you can click on other vouchers and you can search purchase orders from the list of voucher types you can see the order vouchers are displayed there you can select the purchase order and press enter okay the first and most important thing is to select the date Click on the date button and ensure that the dates are on according to the uh, purchase order. You According to the current date, you will select the date and then you will select your supplier name to whom you are going to send this purchase order. And then you will type the mode of payments and the terms of payment. Like here in 30 days, we will make a payment to the supplier. The order number will automatically come. Most of the companies I have seen, they have automated the numbering system. So we here also we have in Tally Prime also we can automate the numbering system. So the number automatically comes up and if you want to change it, you can type as you wish and select the respective ledger, select the item from the list of items. You can select the item and then uh, request it for the quantity. And the rate. If you have second item, you can select the second item. Provide the rate of that particular item. And provide the VAT ledger if if that VAT information need to be provided. You press select the VAT ledger and accept the screen. Okay, so this means that you have generated a purchase order. And the same can be printed and provided to the customer. You can email to the customer. And uh, <clears throat> uh, you can also see the pending purchase orders from the display mode reports. Statement of inventory. You can see the purchase order outstanding. All orders, you can see this particular order is pending from this particular supplier. Once the purchase order is generated, you can click on the print button. You can take a printout of it. And you can also export it as a PDF format and then you can send it to your supplier. This is a normal print preview of the purchase order. You can customize it if you wish to. Otherwise, you can use the default tally uh, format for the purchase order and sending it to your supplier.